Hello and welcome to Trojan Talk. I'm your host, Aaron Taylor. My guest today is Barbara Patterson, here to talk a little about mm -hmm. how students can get involved here on campus. Exactly. Thanks for joining me here today. So, oh, you're so welcome. Glad to. And uh, Barbara, uh, you know, we bring you in here all mm -hmm. the time to talk about ways for students to get involved mm -hmm. on campus. And the, the middle of the year, always mm -hmm. seems like an interesting time for right. students to be mm -hmm. looking to get involved because you think, mm -hmm. oh, it, fall semester, the beginning of the semester, mm -hmm. the beginning of the school year, that's when people want to get out there. But especially mm -hmm. for some people, they're a little bit too busy in the fall to get involved. So mm -hmm. spring becomes a time for them to maybe expand their, their universe a little bit, especially for underclassmen. Mm -hmm. So You know, a lot of the underclassmen, one of their first concerns was to make great grades. Mm -hmm. And we're certainly uh, concerned about, oh, I don't think I want to get involved in anything. I think I just want to concentrate on my classes. <laughs> and so then we hope that once they made their great grades, and they're ready to get involved in something. And we'll remember, hey, you know, I thought about I've got to get my feet wet at Troy, and now it's time for me to get involved in something. And clubs and organizations are certainly looking for them to get involved. And that's one of the things, and, and we've talked about this before, but a lot of students may be reluctant because it's the middle of the year. They think exactly. that these organizations or clubs are already in full gear mm -hmm. and they don't have room mm -hmm. for anybody new, but that's not the case, right? That's not the case. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, they, uh, most organizations, there, there are a few that do not, but most organizations take people throughout the, the uh, academic year. Mm -hmm. uh, even if it's in March and you want to get started with something, a lot of organizations will take you and, uh, and will be very, very happy to have you. But, you know, it's great at the very beginning of a semester to look around, see what signs and posters, check out social media mm -hmm. and say, hey, I think I'm going to go check this out. Grab your roommate and say, let's go over to the BCM. Let's check out the first Bible study the BCM has. Let's go see what Troy Trajan Vision has mm -hmm. and start volunteering and start becoming a part of something. And a lot of this comes from just looking around campus. Uh, you know, it's just, because uh, right now mm -hmm. you, you'll probably see flyers around campus, stuff like that, mm -hmm. and that's a good way to find it. But yeah. another, probably one of the easiest ways is just to come see you in your Absolutely. office, right? So You know, everybody in our office, Sir Aris Williams, Tracy Leverett, myself, we frequently sit down with students and we'll have students pop in and say, oh, I don't know what to get involved in. And we, we'll talk about what their interests are, what their values are. Uh, what they were involved in in high school and say uh, what their majors are and, and, and point out two or three different things that we would like for them to try. I love to see somebody who's like a junior come in who says, oh, you know, I just, I don't know why I haven't gotten involved, but I want to get involved. And then they, they will get involved and then pop back in at the end of their senior year and say, oh, I don't know why I didn't do that from the time that I was a freshman. <laughs> mm -hmm. So we love to have students come in and visit us. And, and not to mention, there's a wide variety of organizations, pro yes. wide variety of Absolutely. interests here on campus. You know, so. that is really one of the joys of a college campus is that so many people have so many different interests and values and we have so many different organizations to meet those needs. And, and I always say, if a student is really interested in something, go ahead and start an organization. It's not that hard. Um, I love to see, and talk about the wide variety of interests, I love to see, sometimes I'll walk down in the Trajan Center and um, uh, we'll have maybe 15 students set up with uh, chess boards and are playing chess. What a great opportunity for somebody who loves chess and wants to get involved with uh, a group of people who love chess also <laughs> and people will not people are so frequently thinking oh I've got to belong to some big huge organization well you don't and and that's one of those things it's the interest goes from from academic stuff to just games and fun I mean exactly. there, was, there was a Quidditch club on campus so I mean uh, like for, yes, for, exactly. for, for every level mm -hmm. of student there's something for them to get involved with and so the you said there's a plenty of variety out there. There's plenty right. of opportunities for there. Exactly. The, and sometimes the students mm -hmm. just gotta, I guess, kind of have the guts to, to step up and do it, right? Right. You know, sometimes it is just stepping through the door, mm -hmm. stepping through the door the first time. But remember, you know, most students are just like you. Most people are looking 
for a new friend to make and uh, as you might be looking for a new friend to make and so we just encourage them to just take that first step because uh, it is really very non-threatening. I'd also like to mention that Greek Life is still looking for new members. Okay. Sometimes people think about Greek Life uh, as being only fall. Uh, IFC uh, will have a, um, a cookout next Wednesday mm -hmm. and then they'll start uh, with Fraternity Rush. So they are really looking for uh, guys who might be interested in um, Fraternity re uh, Recruitment and then our MPHC groups will be having a convocation and then our uh, NPC sororities uh, will know next week who will be having open recruitment okay. and we'll start advertising that. So it's a great time to also get involved in Greek life. Okay, well, if anyone out there is interested mm -hmm. in, in coming and seeing you yes. to find out about mm -hmm. opportunities, yeah. uh, if they want to come find you, where can they find you? We are in the Trojan Center uh, 215 and there's myself. Sidaris Williams and Tracy Leverett and any of us would be more than willing to sit down with a student and talk to them about the opportunities. Well, here's hoping some students take advantage of that and come by and see you. Thanks oh, for joining will. here today. So, right. And thank you for joining us on today's edition of Trojan Talk.